play character. This game is clunky. Very, very clunky. Now for casters or archer builds, maybe it's different. But let me just give you a little bit of a backstory about my controller. It's in perfect condition. It's one of the top line, very, very sensitive controllers. And the controller is in perfect condition. I, have ne I don't damage it, I keep it clean. I wash my hands before I use it. In other words, I don't eat greasy food and then use my controller. If I ever do you eat greasy food, I make sure to clean my controller, I mean clean my hands, wash them with soap. And water thoroughly. So my controller is not the issue. But just watch. Just watch. It's gonna be with the knights. It's going to be with the knights. Up here. These knights. Two of them, apparently. just tried to swing. Well, maybe that was a given. But when I swing in their de general direction, sometimes completely is way off. We'll see if it happens. Nice. Those haven't dropped yet for me. We'll check them out in a minute. Most of, the, most of the time is when I fight the more powerful knight. And by the way, I made a mistake in my previous videos. I said that the uh, knight with the blue cape, which you'll see in a moment, doesn't respawn once you kill it for the first time. I was wrong. <coughs> Excuse me. So far, it's been okay. Not much clunkiness going on with my controller, which I, which I already explained is in top notch. It came with the PlayStation 4. It's not one of those third-party controllers. House. Those are the ones that are really clunky. And I do have one as an extra backup, but I hope I never have to use it. Let's check out that armor. Equipment. The problem is, is my weight ratio goes up to 74.6, which is not good. I want that to remain under 70. For those that don't know, keeping it under 70 is preferable. Otherwise, you're probably going to have your character get owned. Let's go ahead and fight this knight. We'll wait till it turns around and then I'll backstab it. We'll see. We shall see. I'm going to use my shield this time instead of instead of two-handed. Two-handed, of course, it does more damage, but So far, it's been okay. I'm starting starting to get used to this controller a little bit more. I've been rusty since I played this game over two and a half years ago. And now I, I started over as a warrior, which I was before. Two and a half years ago, I made some mistakes. All right, now. Let's see if I can backstab. Let's see. Sneak up, sneak up, sneak up. Oh! Wasn't able to do it. He's gonna buff his weapon. This is a tough, tough opponent. Oh, jeez, I thought he would get me. My armor's pretty decent, though. Whoa! I didn't even see him jump. It was like he teleported. Nice! Oh, ouch! 
run, run, run! I think, I think if he hits me one more time, I'm dead. But I've got heals. Now I'm gonna go two-handed to do that little bit of extra damage. There, that's what I was talking about. I aimed for him directly and completely, completely missed. That's what I meant by being clunky. And like I say, my controller is top notch. I got one of the really good ones when I... Ouch. Nice connect. Ouch. I need to invest more in strength, even though it's, it's at 25. I'll show my stats in a minute. Did you see how I hit the wall instead of him? I was off by a few degrees. This is not very precise like it should be. And that's not my controller, it's the game. It's for melee up front melee combat. It's very clunky. And I'm not gonna risk this anymore. I'm just not gonna risk it. I'm gonna go back to whatever this thing is called, I forgot. Get my heal potions restored. Well, let's watch me fight some more. What I'm doing is I'm farming for a nice shield, a nicer shield than what I've got than what I've got right now. Plus, I'm earning souls. I want to get it to the point where I can one-shot these. shot them, even without the buff, I believe. I think I can one-shot this. Not quite. He had a sliver of hit points left, even, even with my powerful buff. There, did you see it? I aimed right for him, and I swung in a completely different direction. So clunky. Ah, that's so annoying. I still can't one-shot these. Oh, nice, nice, nice. They're teaming up. Let's buff. I must have to roll a critical to one-shot these right now. Wait, is he right there? Yeah, there he is. You see his sword? Now he's gonna he's gonna wait there for just a second. Now he's gonna come out of hiding. Ba boom! Goodbye. Now that was a special attack. Oh cool, I got a heal back. Alright, let's go try Mr. Blue Cape with the red eyes. Whoops, I got this this one to take out still. This is the shield I want. You see that shield? That's what... Oh, I was able to break his guard. Ooh. Ah. I, want, I want all of that armor eventually. See ya. But I'm going to need higher vitality to get my equipment load up to where my poise is higher and also I under under that 70% threshold otherwise I'll just be fat rolling Bump. missed are you kidding I just did a power attack well that was a given cuz he did move out of the way that one actually performed well. This time I've got six heals. So there should be no reason why I cannot win this combat. Don't get too 
confident. Regroup. Regroup. Rebuff. I got one more buff left. That is until I reach another. I can't remember the name. There I there I knew that would work. I just kept hacking at him. Nice! Alright, now let's go level up. Back to the Firelink Shrine. Unless my world gets invaded before I reach that. In which case, I'll just use a Homeward Bone, because I'm not losing almost 7,000 souls against an opponent. A real player opponent, that is. Or they invade other worlds. So far, I've been okay. I haven't, I haven't had any PvP yet. But I am learning how to do it. I mean, preparing myself so that... I'm pretty good at PvP. I'm not the best, but I'm, I'm decent. One day I'll ha have a video. I'll start recording when it happens, and I'll make a video. Because that's how it works. Duh. All right, talk. Welcome home, Ashen Mosby. Level well. up. Then touch take no. All right, now. Vitality is what you see. The equipment load goes up so slowly, but my resistances go up too. But if I do strength, it goes up a decent amount. What vital? What about health? 764 compared to 804. But you know what? I really want to get my ar I want armor. I've always been a tank, like fighter slash warrior build. I've never been a paladin. I'm, I'm just a straight up raw frontline defender tank with a shield, with heavy armor, high hit points. And in, and in Dark Souls 3, there's a lot more that goes into it. It's a lot, it's a lot, a lot more complicated in my opinion, than other games in this genre. So if I go with Vitality, hold on, let's just check something here. Because I am still a little bit rusty, like I said. I haven't played this game in about two and a half years. If I look at my equipment, no. Inventory, no. Yeah, equipment. Look in the upper right-hand corner, next to equipment load, underneath that it says rate ratio 66.1. If I raise my vitality, that number should go down. Which raises my equipment load, which means I can put on better armor. Welcome home, Ashen Ones. Level Very up. Well. Then touch taken. Vitality. Confirm. Let's Farewell, check out my... 64.9. Nice. So I am doing it correctly. So now if I go to inventory... No. Equipment. I'm still... Like I say, you got to bear with me. I'm not ac exactly an expert. 73.3. Wow, I need a lot more to go. Look at the, look at the poise. The poise... I, I, I understand what poise is. A little bit. The higher the poise, the better. But there's a sweet spot if you, if you know. Got to be careful. So that's a big difference. Versus strike, versus poison, versus frost, versus curse goes down. Than what I've got. But I am going to find better armor than this in the future, so... Look at the poise resistance on, not not on the far right hand corner of the screen, but in the middle, underneath curse. It's also got a poise number, which is 12.1. But now look at the right where poise is under equipment load. It says 22.57. 12.1 versus 3.1. See, those numbers don't add up to me for some reason. It must be because my... Oh, it's because my weight ratio is not under the 70%. I don't know. I'm still learning. Even though, like I said... Like I said... I did play this game 
quite a while ago and got my character up to like a level 120, I think, or 100, 100? Maybe it was 110 level. Anyways, I hope you've enjoyed this video. I'm not sure even what it was about in the first place, but thanks for watching.